Estamos de volta. E me parece que o programa agora vai ouvir uma declaração exclusiva dele, o cara que derrotou toda a União Soviética, os vietnamitas e o pessoal treteiro do Afeganistão, o Rambo em pessoa vai dar uma declaração aqui, é isso? Exatamente, Silvestre Stallone hoje, cara. Silvestre Stallone. Rambo, Rock. Aliás, Rock é o filme, é o Creed que vai, que vai ser lançado. Agora é o Creed, exatamente, que é o filho do Apollo Creed, o adversário do Rock no primeiro filme. Eu Você sou viu? fã de Rock, vi, cara. Tá legal? Eu assisti o Creed, cara, o filme tá sensacional. Eu tô, eu tô muito ansioso Você pra ver. Você vai adorar, tá muito bom, muito bom. Tô falando que é o melhor Rock desde Rock. Demais. Eu acho que vai ser indicado O último Rock já foi... Ah, o pessoal de... deu risada que pra ter ignorante tem o um filme do Rock, galera. <risos> Mas eu já gostei do último, do Rock 6, é eu muito já pirei. Bom. Pra... É, não, o primeiro e o último são, Esse... todos são Bom, Esse é melhor que o Rock 6? Você é fã, assim Sou como fã eu. demais. E o Creed tá no mesmo nível, tá excelente. Eu acho que o Stallone vai ser indicado também, merece ser indicado. Pra... O Michael B. Jordan, cara, o filme tá foda, você tem que ver. Tá animal. E, eu... e você falou com ele? Falei, ele falei é com o elenco todo. Foi super legal. Tava nervoso pra entrevistar o Stallone, né, demais. cara? Mas, porra, foi muito legal. Cadê? Eu estou nas escadas do Museu de Arte da Filadélfia, um dos lugares mais famosos do cinema por cenas como essa. Desde criança, meu sonho era refazer essa cena. Assim que cheguei na Filadélfia, eu corri me filmando. Só que ficou uma bosta. Aí pedi pra alguém me filmar. Mas já tinha subido três vezes, cansei e ficou uma bosta. Agora no filme Creed, Rock Balboa é o treinador de Adonis Johnson, filho de Apollo Creed, ex-adversário e amigo de Rock, interpretado agora por Michael B. Jordan, que também foi o tocha humana no Quarteto Fantástico e deu entrevista para um excelente comediante. Man, I have to say that... I have to say that I'm very jealous of you, man, because I love comic books and you got to be Human Torch. Yeah. I love Rocky, now you were doing this job, so, man, come on, man. And you're also younger, rich, and hot, <laughs> than me. <so. laughs> and how it was for you when you knew you, you would be on the movie? I didn't know how big it was going to be. I think, in the, you know, when Ryan first told me about it, you know, he asked me about Apollo, you know, do I want to play Apollo Creed's son? And I was like, yeah, cool, let's do it. And you were not thinking, did God Apollo? Of course I know Apollo Creed, <laughs> but I just, it didn't sink in that the magnitude of the, what the okay. magnitude of the film would be. How, how it was your first contact with, with Rocky? It was like, probably like Rocky II. I right. remember it summer, like around my freshman, sophomore year of high school, I just remember watching it and, and I'm like, wow, this is an incredible movie that today, you know, 20 years from now, I'm still gonna give you that same inspiration on that same feeling. And were you influenced by Rocky? Did you used to drink eggs? <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> No, no eggs for me. No yeah. eggs. Yeah, that's but old school, man. But you're doing a very classic scene on this movie also. You are chasing chickens. Chasing chickens, yeah, yeah. That's the catch. Oh, it's not as easy as you think. The key is the third take, fourth take, when they start to get tired. I have a friend who's very out of shape, and he used to train, trying to catch, but it was another animal. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. It was a turtle. That's funny. How? You were fighting against real boxers yep. in the movie. Did you hurt yourself? Uh, I mean, I got hit a few times. You know, I think it was like more soreness than like really hurt. But you know, I definitely felt punches. You definitely felt. Oh, for sure. It, nice man. Thank you so no much, problem, Michael. Bro. Thank yeah, you so good, much. Bro. Love the work, bro. man. Appreciate it, man. Apesar de conhecido como garanhão italiano, Rock Balboa tinha apenas uma mulher em sua vida, a famosa Adria. A Donis Johnson é mais moleque piranha. Mas assim como o Rock, também tem um romance com uma garota, a cantora Bianca. Só que ele não grita, Bianca! Confesso que eu senti falta. Bianca é interpretada por Tessa Thompson. How it was for you when you knew you would be on the movie? Because I would freak out. You would? I would, of course. Yeah, if you were playing the love interest to Michael B. Jordan, you'd be like, ooh, this is Because he's so hot. And yeah, I would freak out. You would. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's pretty much what I did. So... Really? I, I, I what was your he... first contact? Of watching Rocky one. Yeah, I remember Rocky when he's in the, the pet shop and, you know, he's flirting with Adrian. Yeah, I was like, exactly. oh, that's what flirting looks like. So, yeah, there were things that, there were things that were really memorable to me. Your character is, is a tough girl and uh, yeah. you, you look like one. You, you used to be a, a tough street girl or a preppy girl. I was you were not a, a tough street girl as a no, kid. No, you, you were I've a ballet girl. Well, I didn't do ballet either. I was somewhere, you know, in between oh, two of right. them. But I like to dress and I like Barbie dolls. Your I'm Barbies not were not punching each other, fighting for can. No. No, no, they were occasionally. They were. <laughs> they were occasionally, and, and sometimes they weren't interested in Ken. They were just, you know, hanging out on their own, having lemonade. It doesn't always have to be about a guy. <laughs>
o segundo diretor na história, além, é claro, de Stallone, a dirigir o personagem Rock Balboa é Ryan Coogler, que não apenas dirigiu, mas escreveu o filme. E como foi para você o processo de criar a história? Foi na sua mente por um tempo? Sim, eu me inspirei por meu pai, que era um grande Rocky fã. Ele me passou e nós vimos os filmes juntos. E como foi o processo com o Stallone? Ele estava tipo, oh, não, o Rocky está retirado, não... Sim, foi isso. Ele viu o capítulo para o Balboa, e foi feito. Sim, o que fez ele aberto para fazer isso foi o fato que ele seguiu um outro personagem. Isso me deu uma... Um, um, Gave him uh, the distance from what he did, oh, okay. enough distance for him to feel comfortable, you know. Um, and you were a Rocky fan? You were a child? You used to drink eggs and try those? Yeah, that's the whole thing, nah. Really? <laughs> I, never, I, never, I never drank eggs, man. Oh, you should, I did. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's not that good, but I did. Nah, no, nah, we cook our eggs, man. Like, <laughs> you cook your eggs? Scram we scramble them in. Yeah, and, it's a better know. way to, to eat, <laughs> yeah. And why Rocky dies in the end of the movie? I'm just kidding. People at home are like, what the hell? And why this idiot stay saying this? <laughs> Do you have plans for Creed 2? I, 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 I can't really answer that right now. Like, to be honest, I'm so focused on this right now. I want to okay. make sure that this, so it's tough for me to say. Do you know a Brazilian boxer? I know a lot of Brazilian, like, MMA fighters. Really? Yeah, Gracie's dog. The Gracie's? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That... yeah Spider Silva is real cool. Boxer Maguila, do you know him? Oh, yeah, 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 I heard about him. He sounds like, I'm yeah. a tip yeah, yeah. He sounds like this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Blanca, he's also a very good fighter right, from Brazil. Right, right, right. Big green and, uh... <laughs> so you know a Brazilian fighter. <laughs> yeah, street fighter. <laughs> Em alguns minutos eu vou estar falando com um cara que eu sou fã desde criança, Sylvester Stallone. Se eu estou nervoso? Sim, muito. Ele simplesmente é o Rock Balboa e o Rambo. Com suas palavras, inspirou milhares de pessoas a vencerem na vida. E algumas a fazer coisas idiotas. Como que tá doendo, cara? Escuta aqui, cara. Você quer ou não quer ser um campeão, cara? E também criou cenas marcantes na história do cinema. Stallone, I, I know I'm not supposed to say this, mas, but I'm very nervous here with you, man. I... Don't yeah, I'm more nervous right now. <laughs> no, it's... You inspired me so much since I'm a kid. Actually, you inspired many generations. And I remember when I was a kid and my mom brought me a steak for lunch and I started to, to punch like Rocky. Uh, really? <laughs> and dodging the rice. Oh, How it was for you letting your characters for the first time in Ryan, someone else's hand, in this case, Ryan Cooler's hand? Really approach this thing, not for money, not for glory. He, he's a real artist, passion. Nice. And he had a whole team behind him from, and I said, this actor has something special. Nice. It's, you know, here. And I said, you know, this could be amazing. People your age, they have their own character now, Creed, that speaks to the problems of today. Actually, as soon as I came, arrived here in Philly, I went to the stairs. Because of you, the stairs, they're, it's more famous than the museum. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I, I feel bad about that. I feel... Aquela lá é a escada, as pessoas que subiram correndo. Muita, olha quanta gente tem ali. E esse é o museu. Só tem essa velha. Tá voltando para a exposição. Did someone from the museum call you this time and said, Stallone, you have to do a scene inside the museum, please? Well, Adonis can punch the paintings. I no. wish. I wish they did. I wish. <laughs> Is it harder? To, is it to coach or to fight? Most fighters are terrible coaches. Because they, they just, but guys that were not very good fighters, but a great managers nice. and coaches because they, they're, it's just the way their mind works. To me, this is much more fun to, awesome. to be able to take Rocky's wisdom because Mickey taught him, he's experienced, he's learned from Apollo, so there's a lot in there. You're the only one person who can answer this. Who would win in a fight between Rocky and Rambo? In the ring, Rocky would knock him out. Okay, I agree with you. But outside the ring, Poor Rocky. <laughs> Thank you so much. Demais, cara. cara demais. Cara. Muito legal. É, demais. Sensacional. A Warner, cara, o filme tá excelente. O Michael B. Jordan tá muito bom. Os atores foram muito legais. Ele lembrou de mim quando eu entrevistei ele no Quarteto Fantástico. Foi demais, foi demais. Vocês têm que ver, o filme tá incrível. Janeiro. Janeiro. Janeiro, Janeiro. estarei lá assistindo. Estou ansioso pra ver.